to be a little about it. There's going to be good cops that slip through the fucking cracks. Yeah, that just that was that was my concern. That like, um, because it, it felt like some, especially in the early on stages, it really felt like it was whoever was around the most would have the highest potential of getting picked up, and then, but I mean, there are outliers, and then, yeah, I am a little worried that there are some great cops who are going to be sent to the wayside, um, and then we're left with some questionable. Uh, cop stuff, but we've like yeah, dude. Yesterday, when you were on duty for shift two, eight cops. Eight. eight. I was like eight cops total. 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 It was rough. Jesus. Yeah, and then it picked up like later in the shift three, but it was uh, yeah, it was definitely. It's 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 that time again. That low. That low. Is this your first? Uh, is this your first wave? What do you mean? Like um. The ups and downs of Los Santos. Uh, like, I would yes, yes, I yeah. would say yes. We're definitely in a low period right now of just stagnation, and uh, uh yeah, I would say from someone that's been like, eh, eh, I don't know how to word this while we're in the city, but with any, uh, you know, um, community, uh, there are highs and lows in every single community. It's true. It doesn't matter if it's uh, Los Freaking Santos or, or or Vice City, you know, back in time or Vice City or whatever. There will always be highs and lows. You know, the people that stick through, you know, whatever happens, fucking happens. Yeah, I'm too stubborn to quit. Hey, it, it pays to be stubborn, man. It All right, pays. Coach. I'm just stuck, man. I'm just trying to have a good time. That's fucking whatever That's... fucking happens, happens. Exactly. All right, bro. I appreciate you as always. It's always been a pleasure. Rolling with you and interact with you. I'm going to change up and thank you again for coming on duty to speak to me. Yeah, no worries. Appreciate you, man. Uh, thank you. Hugs and kisses. Mm. Don't forget about this, man. All right. By the way, I turned down a trooper uh, job to be an LSPDA. You turned down a trooper job? Yep. <laughs> I, I, I got the go ahead to be a trooper, guys. Uh, I got the blessing and uh, I turned it down. Uh, by accepting LSPD. I feel that my character is best suited in LSPD because he's always been in LSPD. And I feel that um, once I am more um, like playing Gary Berry and I, and, and I am to a level where Bass uh, feels comfortable with me in within the ranks of troopers, then I will gladly join. But um, I don't feel comfortable. Uh, it's one of those things like don't go if you're not invited type of thing. You never you ever heard that saying where like let's say your friends uh, go to an event, but they don't invite you. And then you have to ask for an invite. It's One of those things where it's like, hmm, like, was I really wanted there to begin with? Or was I just asked to join because... It's now like we're getting to that point where it's like, you know, so I want to be a trooper. I think it's, it's not, it, it sounds cool. I think it could be like a, a new story development for Gary Barry. And like, I actually like was really, really contemplating like, oh, this would be sick. But then I thought like, I talked to Sweets and I was, cause I had shown an interest in the Sweets. And I was like, Hey, like, you know, where are we at? And, uh, you know, uh, they, they allowed me back in back home. So I thought that was cool. I thought that was cool. So. Pretty content with it. I gotta figure out what the LSPD stuff is now. Um, all the thing, dude. It could it could have been me, boys. It could have been me. It could have been me. I I just don't listen. I don't know. One day, one day when I'm when I'm more ready.